What's up, YouTube? This is a video response for DC Graphs, showing some of my uh, top five favorite autographs. Here we go. Kat Von D, her new book, Tattoo Chronicles. Signed Kat Von D, XOXO. I've seen a lot of uh, books that people are selling on eBay. She didn't sign. I don't think really for anybody. I haven't seen that. She signed two books for me, and she only put one of those on there. She knew that one, you know, was for me, I guess, because I was getting another one for my brother. But that's one of my favorites. This weekend, uh, this past year, 2010, uh, Comic Con in New York City. I did very well with Tom McFarlane in two days. If I would have known it was going to be there two days, I wanted to wait on line for the first day for about an hour and a half, two hours, but it was well worth it. Um, I didn't have anything for him to sign. I was just going to have him sign, you know, whatever. Someone uh, gave this to me online. Spider-Man number one when he was uh, drawing for Marvel. And Midtown Comics gave that away to prove that it was signed, which is cool. I mean, I took photos anyway. And I got Spawn number one, which uh, before I, someone gave me this, I bought off somebody for five bucks online, so I had at least something for Todd McFarlane to sign. I also got a baseball signed the next day and uh, an airbrush t-shirt of this cover signed, so I did very well with him for meeting him for the first time. One of my favorite comic book artists. Next is Chris Angel. To Drew and Joy, Chris Angel, 5807. That's when I met him, going on almost four years ago. That was cool. Line was ridiculous. I don't think the bookstore knew the crowd he would draw on uh, you know next I'll swing over instead of carrying the book over sorry for the glare showed you guys this in my NASCAR autographs damn glare let's see if it'd be better if I oh, the lights right over me Jim Kelly Rainy LaJoy Jim Kelly owned the race team for a while he wasn't too uh, happy to sign when he was alone but when I ran into his driver, Randy, asked him to sign it because I've met him a couple times. Then I finally asked Jim to sign it, and he signed number 34, which is the car number, which is rare because usually, you know, his jersey number is 12. Like that. And then Dale Jr. This was back at the Waldorf when the NASCAR used to do the awards at the Waldorf in, uh, in Manhattan, which they stopped doing. Big mistake because now it's in Vegas, but... Yeah, those are my top five. You guys have seen most of this. All my NASCAR in-person autographs. and I've got some other stuff that's actually put away that I got in person also. But that'll be another video for another time. Alright guys, subscribe to DC Graphs. Peace.